Yo, yo, what's going on? I'm back. Sorry it's been a little bit since I sent some emails. I actually write all of them, so that's why this breaks in between, because I'm busy. Um, I wanted to come on here and talk about something I was just thinking of as I'm making my coffee during this um, afternoon session that I'm about to film and do a video for. Um, Just the fact that nobody has it figured out, and don't forget that. I think once you start uh, climbing any kind of ladder, and me personally, after getting more of a following and um, notoriety, and you're meeting people and seeing behind the scenes of certain things, this, that, and whatever, um, it's like you start to realize, man, I thought this person had everything figured out. I thought that they were making a gazillion dollars, whatever the scenario is. I thought that they were they had more ownership in that song than they really do. Whatever the case is, there's a lot of times where um, once, once you pull the curtain back, these people that you're looking at online don't actually have anything figured out. And even the ones that do have it figured out, even the ones that like all their businesses together, maybe their music is killing it, they're, they're doing a lot of things good. There's always other aspects of their life that they're constantly trying to improve on. Um, no matter what it is and i think it's an important topic because especially with this fucking swiping all day shit that's happening even if you even if you're not even thinking about it i think we're subconsciously comparing our lives to other people which is a common thing that everyone talks about now but um it's so true because like i consciously i'm like i don't give a fuck about this but but just the fact that i'm swiping i'm still like it's still just there even if I'm not consciously comparing myself to other people, when something goes wrong or when something goes bad within my Kyle Beats ether, um, I tend to just, you, 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 it, you let it upset you more than it should because you immediately, your subconscious just goes to like, this person who just did this crazy deal or whatever the fuck it is. Um, so it's something I wanted to constantly remind you. Me personally, there's constantly things going up and down my past six years since I started doing this it's insane you have days where you feel like you could uh run from california to the east coast in in, th- in 35 seconds and you have other days that feels like you can't even get up and walk across the hall um and that's it i'm making coffee about to rip a video and crush it and um yeah i just wanted to come on here and and remind you that uh, because otherwise it's just stuck in my head and I feel like I should just talk to you like I can call you on the phone. I think that's the benefit of me doing these things. It's like phone calls that I'll just have with people. I can just spew it out in a broadcast and have it with all you guys. Um, so I hope that helped you think it's true to once, whenever you get the chance to like see behind someone's, you know, whether you get to hang out with some sort of celebrity or some business person, whatever it is, you'll figure it out quickly. Or if you hang out with me, you would be like, man, I thought that fucking, you know what I mean? Whatever. Um, or hopefully it's better than you think. But even, like, there's, there's, always, there's always problems. There's always something that, I, you, like, I'm, I'm just trying to think of ways if you don't have access to a person like that do some free work try to try to get access to one of those people and, and offer them something I don't know who it is maybe it's someone that has 10,000 followers making a living off selling beats do something so that you can see how they operate even to just humanize it because you forget that all these people are human because social media is a fucking highlight reel and like the real shit that goes on doesn't look good like you when i see a ufc fighter online i don't want them to tell me that they're they're afraid to fight even if they are i want them to be confident because that's why i watch it i love to see the i love to to get inspired from these people so um just know that nobody has this shit figured out even if they say they do that's the end of my video go crush the rest of today goodbye